happening here. I've got a super secret mission for you. Head over to the new taco shop on Main Street and buy me a taco. Kun out. Who are you supposed to be? A yoga instructor? Go on through. So then, so then the WAP says to the Polak, if I wanted tits, I'd have beat up the nip in the black guy's hat. <laughs> oh, oh, what do we have here? Looks like we've got another little junior crime fighter, boys. Is that it, kid? Well, the police can always use the help of concerned citizens. I guess we can give our little junior detective a special kitty case to work on. All right, listen up. There's somebody new to town, shaking up the crime families. This is a real bad dude. A kingpin of crime who wants to control all the drugs in the city. We've tracked him to this location here. I need you to go in and neutralize him. You lead point, my boys will be there after. If you take out the drug kingpin, we'll give you this junior detective badge. Pretty neat, huh? Now get out there! Anyone who thinks I'm uppity can go drunk drive their pickups right into their double wives. <laughs> Study hard, kid, and someday you too might become the mayor of a podunk mountain town. Forthy, come play with us big kids! You're just the creep we've been looking for! Is your silence more the brooding type or the empty vessel type? I'm flattered, kid, but a superhero's gotta be pretty special to impress me. You're just the creep we've been looking for. You dare disrupt the flow of chaos? Sorry, superhero. The bank is closed due to a lava emergency. Hello there, you one of Kyle's friends? Sorry, I'm not much for selfies.
Here comes the bulldozer. Okay, you're approaching the hideout. Find a way in, but be careful. He's probably armed to the teeth. Thermal imaging is showing the suspect is in the rear of the house. You should have him in sight. Hey, who are you? What are you doing in my house? Engage! Engage! I don't know what you're doing in my house! Stand your ground! Uh, ah, what the hell do you want with me? Get the hell out of my house, goddammit! Turn fire! What's wrong with you? That'll teach you to corrupt our Look, youth I'm with drugs. I'm just drugs. defending my castle. Kick him! Kick him when he's down! You are trespassing in my home! Stand your ground! Return fire! That'll teach you to corrupt our youth with drugs. Holy shit, you're the real deal, superhero. That's one less violent degenerate this town has to deal with. Please come by and help us again. Okay, kid, I'll give you a pity follow. What the heck? Thanks. Well, okay, sure. Thanks, new kid. See you online. Come here, Forthy. I'll show you how to pop wheelies. What's wrong, Forthy? Chicken? I'm the f f fastest kid in town. Good, good going, new kid. New kid, call on me whenever you want to get somewhere. <laughs> call on me whenever you want to get somewhere. <laughs> call on me whenever you want to get somewhere. <laughs> Getting your face fixed, Buckaroo? Good for you. Is it itchy in here, or is that just my face? Happy Halloween, new kid. Wait, is it Halloween?
Let's make a deal. I'll follow you on Coonstagram if you take a selfie with me. How does that sound? <laughs> now you have a cool bomb. Move along, we're creating chaos. Sorry, superhero. The bank is closed due to a lava emergency. Welcome to Freeman's Tacos. If there's anything I can interest you in, well, you just let me know. Freeman's Tacos is completely craft your own. You know what crafting is, don't you? Just open up that crafting menu, and we can get started. You can combine food items into whatever you like. Let's start with a staple, the burrito. A warm tortilla wrapped around, well, any old something. Here, I'll give you what you need to get started. This here shows how much food you need to fill up that tortilla. Now to just put it all... Well done, kid. Now that you've got your first taste of crafting, let's dig in. You can combine food items into whatever you like. Go ahead. See what happens if you combine a burrito and an enchilada. Congratulations, new kid. With an enchilada and a burrito, you've crafted an enchirito. That's the first time anyone's ever done that. And what the hell? Have a few more recipes. They might just save your stupid ass. Nothing left to do now but document this moment in human history with a selfie. Okay, let's snap and just one more thing. They say that some farts are so powerful they can actually bend the fabric of time. You be careful out there. Get your head out of the clouds. <laughs> A 
look at you with all that storage on your device. Outstanding! Praise the Lord, little cuckoo kid. I can't wait to complete my collection. Thanks for your help, new kid. but no screwing around. Well, okay then. Okay, now don't go screwing around. Come back tomorrow, eh? Hi, you're the new kid, right? Oh, great. Thanks for coming. Have a seat. Okay, this seat right over here, please. Okay. As your counselor, you can talk to me about anything, okay? I understand you want to talk about sex. Mm -hmm. Okay, see, I'm highly trained in um uh, sex issues, okay? And you don't have to be afraid. Okay, new kid, it's it's really simple. When uh when you want to talk about your sex, you simply you can start by simply saying, you know, I'm I'm a boy or a girl or other. 
Boy, right, exactly, you got it. Now, new kid, this might get confusing, but listen close, okay? If you were born a boy, that's called being a cisgender boy, okay? Or cis for short. But, well, you, you might have transitioned into being a boy. You see what I mean? If you were not born a boy, but now uh, uh, I d identify as one, well, that's called being transgendered, okay? Or trans for short, okay? So, uh, do you identify as being cisgendered or transgendered? Okay, can you just hang on a minute? I need to call your parents. Just take a second. Uh, hello, this is Mr. Mackey, the school counselor. Yes, hi. Uh, I have your child here in my office, and well, he's just let me know that he's cisgender. That means he identifies with the sex he was assigned at birth. Oh, you knew that? Okay. Well, no, no, it's it's fine. I just wanted to make sure that you knew he had other options. You know, you don't you don't always have to go with the first hand you're dealt. Huh? Okay. Yeah, no, that's that's great. That's great to know. Uh, I think I can really maybe be of help from here on out. Uh, thank you very much. Okay. Bye bye now. Okay. Well, I'm really glad we had this talk. As a cisgendered male myself, I know how hard it can be out there for a boy who chooses to love someone of the opposite sex. Just remember, love is love, even if you're a guy who happens to like titties. Okay? <laughs> Just be careful, okay? Because there's there's a lot of people out there who don't accept you for what you are, and then you're gonna have to deal with them, okay? So, uh, but come see me anytime. Yeah! Ah! That's not. Ah! Huh. My parents were out partying until 3 a.m. last night. Dump well, well, well. If it ain't a cisgendered boy. We don't take kindly to your types around here. Let's welcome this thing to our town. I'm gonna punch you straight, just like I did Dale that one night in 94. I'll whoop you like your daddy never done. Yeah, that settles it. Beating you kids up was definitely the right decisions. That's some nasty shit, dude. Just take that lying down, butt boy. America, love it or get your ass kicked, socialist. Yeah, no fair. Feel the wrath of human height. <laughs> I love when you sear them like that. Seals in the juices. Yeah! 
Ouch for you, dude. Yeah, I saw that coming. Yeah, I don't even want to fight these guys. What if I get contact drunk? Don't be scared, bug boy. It's just a little taste of your future. Yeah. <laughs> Belly blood I'm okay with. Drinking blood, that's just wrong. Don't knock it till you try it. Tube-like mouth parts are a gape in amazement. Dude, you are trying way too hard. Huh, huh, ah. Yeah, that's right. Shut those laser eyes and think about your stupid hero concept. You could have been human monster trip. Yeah, human ATV. Here I go. Going for blood, guys. Go nuts, new kid. So far. Come back to the coon layer. I think we should advance your character. Coon out. I'm the fastest kid in town. R -r Righteous. Fuck. You, Mom. Ah, new kid. Come, take a seat. All right, well, how's it going out there? Okay, good talk. Uh, well, listen, I think you show some potential, and uh, I'm gonna upgrade you to somebody's sidekick or something. Congratulations. I just maybe wanted to talk about your superhero character a little bit. Um... Your character sucks, to be honest, and I think I'm gonna let you dual class. Let's pick another ability to add. So what kind of skill set are you looking to add to your repertoire? Cyborg. Elementalist. Blaster. A blaster with range powers like Cyclops. Okay, I think those two will work nicely together. But now we're gonna need to change your backstory, too. So let's go back again to that fateful night. Back when you were little. You did lay awake that night, but the reason you couldn't sleep was because you wanted to make the world a safer place. You walked to the mirror. You looked in the mirror and wondered if anyone would ever love you. And then you heard a noise, but, but it was a baby crying. Out in the hallway, you saw two guys attacking a helpless baby on the floor. You had to stop them from hurting that baby, didn't you? You knew you had the power to stop them, and so you called upon your newly discovered power. As a blazing blaster hero, you began to overheat as the fire in your belly ignited. You wasted no time delivering sick burns into the villains before you. As the flames cleared, the intruders realized what they were up against. Shit, this little flamer means business! Didn't your mom tell you not to play with fire? The intruders moved in to attack! You've left us no choice, kid. Oh, oh, oh. With the enemies closing in, you gave yourself some space by knocking your foes back! But 
the intruders wouldn't take getting pushed around lightly. Hey, you can't push us around like that. <laughs> Little did they know, they set themselves up for destruction. So much range. I'll just get out of the way. His comrade fallen, the extra ugly one closed in. Not so hot now, you little flamer. Yeah, we showed him. You were gravely injured, but the intruder's blows only awakened the fires that burned beneath you. You swallowed the pain and unleashed your ultimate attack. So you beat them. You swept the baby up in your arms to take him somewhere safe, and then that's when the unthinkable happened. You saw your dad fuck your mom. And from then on, you had to live with the fact that because you were busy helping a baby, you couldn't stop your mom from being fucked by your dad. That's heavy, man. I'm really sorry. I know you probably want to know why. Why your dad fucked your mom, but those are answers you'll have to find for yourself. Unit friends alert! Unit friends alert! Seriously guys, alert! Alert! Security friends alert! This is Coon, what's happening? It's the Freedom Pal! What have they done now? Just get to Main Street! Hurry! We're coming! Coon! Ow! Well, new kid, looks like you might be needing those newfound powers. Follow me! No time to waste, butto. This way, butto. Toward the bus stop. It's the quickest route. My coon sense is on fire. Freedom Pals is on the move. A confrontation is brewing. Yes, this way. Keep going. Towards the bus stop. Man, escort missions are the worst. God damn it! So close. Head towards Main Street, butthole, and gird your loins for battle. Yes, a little further. You were supposed to be a duo, remember, Tweak? Yeah, I remember. So when I walked out on Coon and Friends, you should have walked out with me. I like Coon and Friends. Because you had your own movie. Thank God you're here. They're really going at it. Super Craig had to have movies before Wonder Tweak was introduced. It made no sense otherwise. Your whole group makes no sense! Because you're a traitor, Tweak, and now you're with a group of super traitors. This was started by you! By people who thought there should be preferential treatment to certain heroes! We aren't the ones who walked out of the fucking franchise, Mysterion! Eric, you must listen to me. Right now, I'm speaking to you telepathically. Get out of my head, Timmy. Your franchise is going nowhere. Face the truth, Eric. You guys are kind of douchebags. He just called us douchebags, in my mind. He did? All right, you son of a bitch. <laughs> Motherfucker! Good friends, deal with these assholes! Let's dance. I mean, not literally, because I don't dance. Let, let's punch. Crime is a disease. I'm the cure. Ooh. Satisfying. 
Get the feeling life is punishing you for being a dick, Tweak? Go! Who needs to get lasered? Ugh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, burning hair. I'm not bloodthirsty anymore. <laughs> Today, you cross paths with the wrong immortal fourth grader. Car! Car! You trying to get killed or something? Fuck you, dude. It's Civil War, dick. Clear! Clear. My turn. Got something for ya. Hurt? What a surprise. I will right wrongs and triumph over evil! And not meet you! Wait, me? Ow. That's going to leave some scars. Oh, I'm up? Okay. <laughs> Fucking lasers! It's time! You won't see me coming! Am I up? Suck on this, Jamal Town. of this new kid. Okay, here we go. Ah, oh, just give me a minute to drain these corpses. Oh, jeez. That just didn't, I didn't mean that. Good job, new kid. You're really getting the hang of this. Hey, wait. What about code? Oh, shit. Come on. Code, what happened? Timmy got away? <laughs> He completely raped my mind. You okay? No, seriously, you guys. He fucked the shit out of my brains. Uh, I grabbed him. We fought for a little bit, but his, his mental powers are too strong. So we did all that for nothing? Not quite. I got Timmy's cell phone. You did? There's sure to be a lead on that. Let's get this back to base. Super Craig can analyze it. Uh, hello. Is this the little superhero who's getting all the followers on Instagram? Your presence is requested at City Hall. The mayor of South Park wishes to speak with you. Don't make her wait. I got boob pics, Forthy. Check them out. What's wrong, Forthy? Shit yourself? Hello, young person. I'm the mayor of South Park. You must be very excited to be here. Well, all right, look. You might be able to help me. This new crime wave in town, it isn't a coincidence. Some group or someone is trying to make me look bad. 
The more crime goes up, the more people start calling for my head. Whoever is behind this wants to see me get replaced. I need people like you. Please, find out who is behind the crime wave in our town. My political life depends on it. Cancel all my meetings today! Uh, you don't have any meetings today, ma'am. Excellent. Keep up the good work, Aid. Here, pussy pussy. I'm the f f fastest kid in town. Catch you later. Fuck you, Mom. There you are, butthole. Dude, you gotta keep Mosquito away from the- Alright, let's get to work. What have you found, Super Craig? Timmy's phone has a bunch of notes in it. Something about a girl who has information about all the criminal activity in town. What girl? It just says, find the girl with the dick tattoo. What girl in town has a dick tattoo? I don't know, Mosquito. But the Freedom Pals must think she's the key to finding the missing cat. If the Freedom Pals find her before we do, they'll get the $100 reward. We cannot let that happen. We have to stop the Freedom Pals from having a sweet franchise. At all costs. Then we have to find the girl with that tattoo tonight. Fast Pass is right. We all have to sneak out of our houses tonight and search the entire town. What do you say, new kid? Are you up for it? Look, if you want to be a coon friend, you have to learn to communicate. Yeah, who let this guy join us anyway? Go easy on him, you guys. He's had a tough life. When he was six years old, his dad fucked his mom. What? I'm sorry, friend, but it's time they learned your tragic backstory. Butthole doesn't trust anyone because his dad fucked his mom and he couldn't do anything to stop it. That doesn't make any sense. I know. How could the person you trust do that to the only other person you love? Carmen, everyone's dad fucked everyone's mom. Huh? That's how it works, stupid. Our dads fucked our moms. Oh, right. So does that mean your dad fucked your mom, Cam? Huh? Yes! My dad fucked my mom! That's why I'm here! Don't steal his backstory, dude. That's not cool. You're so fucking stupid! Every human alive on Earth had a dad who fucked their mom and- Stop, stop! This is not what's important right now! We need to find the lady with the dick tattoo! Yeah, let's get home so we can prepare for evening missions. Let's go, coon friends! He's such a fucking idiot! It's okay, calm down. I'm afraid you'll have to deal with that kind of bigotry your whole life, butthole. Oh. When people don't understand, they lash out. I'm going to let you be a sidekick tonight to one of the coon friends. Go home and sneak out after your parents are asleep. I'll fill you in later. <laughs> 